Special Olympics needs to be given opportunities to individuals that don't have the opportunity to be on the playing fields, to play sports, um, gives them an opportunity to build part of a team. I started working at a group home and I, my, one of my jobs was to take them to Special Olympics bowling and to basketball practice and one of the teams did not have a coach and I played basketball in high school so I took on that team and took them to state. I play for Team Missouri because I have been a coach at World Games. I have been a parent liaison. I wanted to be an athlete. I wanted to play alongside one of my athletes and be a part of, be in the trenches as you call it. Opening ceremonies and being in playing with the athletes. Oh, I have a lot of hobbies. I love to do handmade um, cards, I do scrapbook. Um, I do, I like to give um, birthday presents. So I'm always looking for things. I'm always looking for bargains and shop. I would like to say a shout out to my husband because he's always been very, very supportive of me. In the 35 years I've known him most of my <laughs> career with Special Olympics and he's always been there pushing me and being there to be my sounding board. And he's always the one, you know, he's always let me do what I wanted to do with Special Olympics. And when I asked him if I could do this and it was a year long commitment, he goes, well, is it work or is it fun? And I said, it's fun. He goes, go for it. I don't know, we're pretty competitive in bocce. We have some really good bocce players, but we're just looking forward to meeting you all and having a great competition.